Hey guys, today I want to review some type of wearing rod here I'm using and I would recommend what type of rod for you know learner to use to buy uh, for good price, good uh, quality, the well is very nice. So in my hand here I have four type of rod mainly I'm using. So the first one 6010. 6010 the good fast free fast free rod this one the rod is using like for where you know you have to weld a lot of we need deep penetration or maybe the fitting or the metal is dirty and got pain on it the second one is 6013 6013 when you weld with some over paint and oil normally the, the, the too heavy slack it will create like slack in cushion so 6013 normally you well you know just random business we don't use in they don't use in structural welding here goes the last two is 66 uh, 70 16 and 70 18 low hydrogen rods they use a lot in structural welding 70 18 uh, use for welding over like welding pipe welding so i will show you now different uh, characteristic and different brand so with the brand of the best brand right now and good price for low hydrogen rod is Mag Magma Well. The very good price. That's only twenty five dollars. This one is twenty five dollar for a pack. Why are the company they sell about seventy to eighty more than eighty dollar for a pack? Sick well had 70 16 quite good very good 70 16 rod boc boc very expensive but quality uh, it's, it's not very good i use this one only for general purpose general purpose rod general purpose for you know you do some tech uh, between the fitting or the pipe or well some small frame this could be So with the first rod I'm using is 6010. I well at 95, 95 M. Okay. So second rod is 6013. I well at 115 m.
70, 16, I well at 115 M. Seventy eighteen, I well at hundred twenty five M. So this one, 60, 10, 60, 13, 70, 16, 70, 18. So here you go. 60-10 60, 13 has a lot of spark you know splatter too many it's it, it not very clean at all 70 18 very clean 70 16 uh, not as clean as 70 18 So here you go. So 6010 doesn't have, have doesn't have a lot of splatter. 6013 has quite a lot of splatter. 60 uh, 70 16 also. But quite a nice bit, you know, very quite a nice a bit color there. 
and 7018 very nice so i reckon if you are you know just learning uh, how to welding how to do welding or learning i think practice with 70 10 quite too good 70 18 70 16 also need to practice this because the two type of rod using a lot in structural welding and 60 10 and 70 18 uh, for pipe welding 60 13 only use at home in your garage or maybe just you know none structural type welding okay guys today i show you guys just you know the difference between the type of rod uh, already i know i i will show you next time to weld some pipe thank you have a nice day